hello everyone. So I'm going to talk about this particular artwork, uh, art piece that I've been currently working on past, um, on and off past few weeks. Um, this is a little different to uh, my usual style. Um, it is a true uh, amalgamation of where east meets west, you could say. Um, the tower here, which is local, is very much that uh, traditional uh, English castle, uh, European castle look to it. Um, it, it has been uh, renovated uh, for a beautiful um, holiday net. Uh, so this piece will hang in, in the tower. Um, but of course, very Western style, and perhaps the, the landscape itself is, is Western style. Uh, but the, the application is much like uh, tanker painting um, in very uh, flat uh, colours that are carefully brushed, a very fine brush uh, to shade. Um, I'm using, for those of you who want to know the technical stuff, the spec, I'm using this um, Lasco uh, paint. It's uh, an acrylic, acrylic paint, um, but very opaque, and it behaves uh, more or less like a bit more like a gouache. It's uh, the it doesn't have such a high uh, amount of plastic uh, in there, so it, it works very well um, for this style, especially on a large uh, canvas like this. This is an another difference. Uh, with my work is that I'm working on canvas. Um, so here you see the landscape. The landscape which goes off into the, the distance here. Uh, these are all uh, locations that may be recognised here of the uh, Brecon Beacon National Park. Now typ typical here in, in the Y Valley, especially in the morning, is you get this during the summer you get this white mist. So here the mist is coming out of the valley, blowing up out of the valley and forming these uh, very typical, uh, you could say Tibetan clouds or clouds that are usually um, within uh, tank painting. And then bellowing up further, these big cumulus clouds here of different hues with a, a typical outline uh, a darker blue here and this frames the, the composition now you'll see trees here looking a little dead at the moment it's because uh, I've yet to add the green foliage which will um, cover quite a bit of this cloud here and here but there will be breaks through um, the foliage to, to see part of the, the clouds uh, and the uh, sky uh, in the background down here, there will be um, a lot more green detail here. It's, it's actually a meadow, which is in front of the tower. And the tower itself um, will have uh, some detailing put in of the, the stonework. I can't decide if this is going to be the sun or the moon. At the moment, it's looking sort of moon-like. So I will gild this either silver or gold or palladium leaf and these very soft linear uh, clouds drifting in, which I'll work on more adding um, little touches of, of uh, colour as if rainbow.